car milk prices, they seem pretty standard, but what is this? Manager special, these eggs are old. Holy moly, huh? Looks like we're gonna get some of these. Get some for my mom, too. Here. Still $4 a pound. They're pretty, though. Frozen oxtails. They're four nineteen a pound. Are you serious? That's nuts. So these short ribs are cheaper than the tails. I, I don't even get that. But I still feel like they're not that great a deal. Terrible. Dollar sixty. Um, I'm just not super into these right now. Five pounds. So it's a big family tag. For this week, this is a good deal. And I want to show you. Look at how big this is. And it's a solid piece. It's like one piece. Huge. I'm gonna get this little $13 one, I think. Here's our egg prices, $1.15. And our milk, pretty standard, $1.89. Sit. Okay, so this is like a massive grocery haul for me, but I am like $3 under. So. We're going to start off with this. I got this at Aldi's. It's on sale, but I really wanted it because I was hungry for it, and it's kind of a lot. I feel like there's three separate servings in here. I'm not sharing that. I'm eating it for me. Underneath of this is it's, it's a full case uh, of these sliced carrots. They're on sale for $0.49, cents, and essentially Evelyn's class is having a canned food drive. So I'm this whole thing, this $6, is going for her... Uh, class. Um, carrots were on special. These are two pounds for $1.29, which is not the best deal ever, but it is coming around to um, potato and cabbage and corned beef time, and this goes right with this. And these also keep forever in the fridge, uh, so I got two of those, so I spent a dollar or two dollars and sixty cents there. Cabbages were on sale. They were fifty cents a pound, which is pretty pricey in my mind they should be 33 cents or less I did get one two three four and I probably have about ten dollars in cabbage um, uh, because I just needed them I want some of them for um, my keto foods I was actually hungry for them if these were not on sale, I would have still bought at least one because I'm hungry. I got three, one, two, three loaves of bread at all these. These were 85 cents a piece. Okay, so let's look at the middle of the table. These were on sale for $2.29 for a three pound bag at Save a Lot. I got one, two, three, four bags. I got two bags of pork rinds for my salad and to snack on because we are back to keto full time now that we're home from Prague. These were on manager special for 75 cents, which tells me they're probably going to go out of date. Um, and I'm not seeing the date on them presently, but that doesn't matter to me because we use a lot of eggs. I can cook them, like hard boil them, and they'll have another week or so life left in them. But we, um, is that the date here? No, I don't know what that is. Anyway, um, at Save a Lot, I got two lemons. They were 50 cents a piece, and it's because of Lent, which is why this was on sale. That fish also, um, and I probably will not get any more uh, during the Lenten season. But I always get some, um, yeah, lemons, just because. Blueberries were on sale for a dollar 19 or something. Anyway, I got two of them. They were on pretty good sale, and I thought it's kind of a big container, probably the same as the the tall one. Anyway. I got that for the girls. I got this is a dollar ninety nine, I think, for flour tortillas. I just feel like this is something I don't have on hand, and it kind of goes with this. So whenever I pull out some ground beef or um, chicken and do fajita type stuff, it makes a full meal for everyone to have them in like a taco shell, even a soft fajita, whatever. 
it just is good. Um, I got one, two, three, four heads of iceberg lettuce. They were like a dollar nineteen, which it was real pricey for me. I got four cans of light tuna and water, seventy nine cents regular price. Just again, something I don't have any of, and it goes with this. Sometimes I like to put a whole can or half a can in my salad, mix it up. It's real good. We're getting over here to this meat pile. It is literally it's a pile of meat. Um, I did get this, even though it was not really that great of a price. Sometimes you're just kind of in it because you're interested in having that, and I'm going to have that. So, one of the things that's on sale is point cut brisket for $2.99. Flat brisket is $3.99, and here is the difference between the two. I'm going to make a... I'm going to have to go... Those kids are making me nuts. All right, so if you imagine a brisket is this. This is the flat part, and then there's this pointy part that's attached, and that's the point. They cut this off, and they sell this as the point, and they leave this, and the flat is called the flat. And the point is on sale now. The flat will probably be on sale next week. It's all the same part of the, the meat. So I did get two of these, and I tried to get not terribly big ones. Um, so they were $2.99, 1041 for one. And then my second one is not as big, 906. Chris doesn't particularly care for it, whereas I could eat this like every day of my life with like a whole head of cabbage. Uh, the other thing that I got, because this was on sale for 99 cents a pound, was whole, whole, this was the smallest one they had. This thing is huge. It's definitely two pieces. But there was one in there that was one piece. It was like $18, and it was just one piece. It was huge, still at 99 cents. So that is what I got. This, who helped me? That's right. Who just came home from school? <laughs> anyway, so that was my grocery haul. Oh, did I tell you that the eggs were 75 cents? I don't know if I, they were on manager special. I think I talked about the manager special and didn't actually say what it was. So, anyway, I gotta go try and figure out how to get this in the fridge. Hey, don't put, put that down until we get it put away. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.